Turning our attention now to consumer news, there are only 22 shopping days left until Christmas. And if you missed out on the doorbuster deals on Black Friday or aren't one for fighting the crowds, that doesn't mean you can't snag a great deal on holiday gifts and support local businesses today, which is Cyber Monday. NBC 6's Jenna Jordan joins us now in Studio Control, sharing more of the impact it has on online ordering. Jenna, good evening. Hi, Dan. The countdown to Christmas is on, and that means the holiday shopping season is officially here. Some local retailers say you can still shop small without setting foot in a store. The Davis family has been in business for more than a century. When our great-grandfather started the business, they were still having cattle drives in front of the store. Lee Davis, part of the fourth generation, outfitting men at this store that's seen its share of changes through the years and not just the fashions. We're talking about the advent of the telephone and communication in general. Davis is clothing and outdoor on the forefront of the digital age as one of the first locally owned small businesses to take their products to the World Wide Web and online sales are boosting business substantially. Normally during the year we may ship between 50 and 100 orders per day. But on Cyber Monday, two or three hundred orders today. With about a hundred of those packed by noon. We try to take care of our e-commerce customers just like we take care of our brick and mortar customers. That personal touch is something that sets small businesses apart. The Bossier Chamber of Commerce says they offer resources to help local businesses adapt to today's mobile society. It's critical that we all meet uh, the needs of what's happening and sometimes that means we have to change and do things a little bit differently. Experts say the convenience of buying online has retailers set to cash in on record-setting sales on Cyber Monday. When the market is way up, up, as it is right now at an, at at an all-time high, people tend to feel more prosperous and so they tend to, to, be, uh, to spend more money. But financial advisor Tommy Williams says spending with credit and supporting the local economy isn't necessarily a bad thing, especially when you can find a deal you're comfortable with. Should they buy now or should they wait to see if they can get a better deal? And uh, there's no way to, to know that. One thing the Davis family knows, they're helping spread Christmas cheer one order at a time. We're very grateful that God blessed our business. And so it continues. You still have until midnight tonight to cash in on Cyber Monday sales and also help support some local businesses. Dan? A lot of people will be doing just that. Jenna, thanks so much.